This announcement was made by Citizenship Minister Winston Felix following the conclusion of the third multi-agency coordinating committee meeting held at the ministry's new Shiv Chanjapal Drive office. According to the minister, the resettlement area will allow the Venezuelans to be self-reliant. It is intended that we develop a like a homestead, right? Where families are accumulated, individuals are accumulated, and eventually we can move them into cash crop farming, right? We can encourage that. So that in the first instance, they can feed themselves. The Citizenship Minister went on to say that the agencies on the committee will continue to play their roles in lending whatever assistance is necessary to those in Region 1 while assessing the migration of Venezuelans into the Cayuni Mazaruni region. In the meantime, the Ministry of Health is continuing its vaccination. I think they did 104 for last week. I think they, they did a number of vaccinations last week. Immigration is continuing the registration and support work. And the police is also falling through with the support work uh, to this committee. So all agencies locally are locked into this committee to provide services and support for the Venezuelans in Guyana. The committee has also been working alongside the United Nations Children's Emergency Fund, UNICEF, International Organization for Migration, IOM, and the United Nations Human Rights Council, UNHRC, to determine the areas of collaboration and support. Only two weeks back, Region 1 Chairman Brent Null Ashley decried the lack of support from Central government in providing assistance to the high influx of Venezuelan refugees, which is putting a strain on the region's already small budget. Reporting for the Evening News, Vanu Manik Chand.